Hello everybody, welcome to another YouTube tutorial. So it's been a week or so and that's because I've been busy. Um, but anyway, onto the tutorial. Um, so in this tutorial we're going to be integrating Essentials and our plugin. So in this example we're going to use Essentials Economy. Just ignore that. Um, so what we need to do is we're just going to include the Essentials jar file. Now you're going to have to have Essentials installed on your server or the class loader can't find it. And if you don't know what a class loader is, it just loads all the plugins for bucket. Usually if you get an error you'll see class loader blah 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 at the start. So once we've imported it, what we need to do is in this what we're simply going to do is um, we're going to create it so that when someone does our test command it's going to give them a hundred of our currency so first thing we need to do is to check with essentials if our player is in the currency system now what you can do is you can go economy dot player exists then he dot get name just like that and what that'll do for you um, is it will just check if the player is in the economy system now what you can do is you can go economy dot add then the player name and how much money so you can put 100 in there and it should give them 100 when they do the command now I can tell you this works but I'm not going to test it right now as I am currently um, doing something else and Minecraft will be quite laggy but this is a simple code and it taps into the essentials commands as you can see here the API sector you can do a few things with essentials and this is how you use other plugins such as remote entities etc I hope you enjoyed this tutorial remember if you've got any suggestions or problems leave them down below also subscribe if you want to see more of these tutorials thank you for watching